It's official and it is happening right now. Philips Fidelio X3 and their very brand new update to their, I think their most popular headphone ever there. Their Shape 9500 is getting an update to the Shape 9600. All the two models are going to be coming out next month, September. This is very interesting and a very good, um, refresh to the uh, to the um, gold standard earphones uh, headphones that really brought them out and made them very popular on the market for value and sound now see the the previous x2 fidelio was i think one of the highly rated headphones that came out a couple of years ago the same with their refreshed x2 hr now the thing here is that not everyone likes the sound signature a lot of people still did not give it rave reviews some people said it was below average in sound why some said it was very good very very good um, the only headphone that really got a ton of praise, even for its low cost, was the Shape 9500. A lot of people were saying it was a fantastic set for gamers, people that wanted the best performance for gaming at a, at a low price below $100, should consider getting the Shape 9500. So with the new update to the Shape 9600, this should be the new standard uh, for the modern headphones, at least for the next one or two years before they probably update it again. The Fidelio X3S are the company's latest flagship open back headphones, M squarely at audio files. The company says the Fidelio X3 op offers open back, feather light, comfort with pristine tuning. Uh, it comes with a 15 millimeter uh, pro pro uh, pro my drivers, uh, which are gel filled for additional dampening and has a frequency response from five hertz all the way up to forty thousand hertz. Uh, the sensitivity is a um, hundred decibels at one milliwatt sensitivity. It's um, fairly decently powerful especially if you're really running from uh, from a mobile source you probably need something a little bit more powerful to really get the best out of it um, the thing here is that the the body is made of um, metal and then you get your leather your little leather covering and uh, a very comfortable ear pads so that you can actually use this for long listening hours and you'll be good with this particular model the x3 will be priced at 350 dollars should be available in september in the us so anyone can go out and pick it up um i'll probably see whether I can get my hands on it probably by the end of the year or early next year so that I can review it on the channel for you guys. Then the ship 9600 is the affordable model. It's uh, quite comfortable. It should be able to still play very well. It's coming with a 15mm Nidium drivers as a frequency response down to 12 hertz and all the way up to 35 thousand hertz um sensitivity is 101 that's 101 decibels um has a connection for 3.5 and can be converted to 6.3 with an adapter um the headband is a reinforced and durable steel so with it so basically it should be able to last you for a while uh, it is not going to be available but right now um, I think until sometime in September but 
the price for it will be a reasonable $130. So um, these are headphones targeted at audio files um, for different price points. So if you are in a market and you want this, um, the new ship, ship 9600 would be just very good for you and it would not be too pricey uh, nor will it be too unreasonable for anyone to lay their hands on in fact i can see myself buying this particular model before even their x3 um this is reasonably priced and i think within the ballpark of what i can afford so that's it um basically what i have for you right now subscribe to our channel like our content i'll see you guys next time